getting initial values uh, using standard pi point formula, diagonal pi point formula, you will get un of 0, u2 of 0, up to u9 of 0, depending on problems. So, how many grid points are you getting, depend on boundary itself, that is the domain. Last problem we then want to for 0 to 4, x minus y of 0 is from 0 to 4. u1 of 0, u2 of 0, u3, suddenly u9 of 0, we got. Once if I get the initial value, then I will use the left band. What I told, left side you can take a n plus 1 position, top side you can take a n plus 1 position, right side n position, down is n position you can take. Then you, idea of n plus 1 position is equal to 1 by 4, this n plus 1 like this can be number. Then we can one problem of two second iteration is stopped. Now another problem I have there given. Uh, <coughs> but we stop at that with second problem. Then second problem or I explain it soon. Are you able to see my screen on a few? Yes, sir. Yes? Yes, sir. Can Somebody asked, somebody asked me something, any doubt? This again, everything I explained last class, UXX, UY, but UXX, how can you write? Then stand, diagonal pi pi formula, we can write it. This thing is equal to this plus, this plus, this plus divided by four. R is called standard pi point formula. And then diagonal pi point formula is a common side we take. This is equal to this plus this plus this plus this. This is for using the initial value and use. Once if I get the initial value, I will go for the level iteration. So this type of the problem then how do you do level iteration? This is where this, this position is n plus one position. This is n plus one plus next stage. This is the end stage. This is the end stage. This is the ui of j n plus one position is equal to this. Already I know you know this is become i minus one comma j. This is become i comma j plus one. This is i comma i plus one comma j. This is uh, i comma j minus one position. So from from the if you know it points more no into i and j, you don't want it to zero. Then this is explaining how to do this. Already one problem we completed this. This problem already ux express u y is equal to 0, 0 is less than 4, 0 y less than 4. We have 0 y is equal to 0, we have 4 y is equal to 8 plus 2 y, we have x comma z x square y 2, we have x comma x square 2, take the text to k is equal to 1. This problem already I have done in board actually, but then. Initial values we got. For first, this problem got to it and U5 we got it. In once if we got a U5 standard, then we got the U9 using diagonal. Then U7. Once if we get a U7, then U8. Then U4, U1, U2, then U3, then U6, U4, U10. Then we got the Similarly, this problem we completed last class. Boundary condition given, table everything is given. Here the value of UXY and the boundary of square given figure evaluate. U of XY satisfying in across equal to X square U is equal to 0. Pivoted points are the figure. Everything. So this point is U4, this point is U3, this point is U1, this position point, this point is U1. This thing writing is going confused. Boundary values given, this is 1000, this point is 500, this point is 0, 0. This is zero, this is 500, this is 1000, this is 1000, this is my plus one. This is 1000, this is 1000, this is 2000, this is 2000, this is 1000. Okay. 
these are the boundary conditions actually this place is you know this intersection point this intersection point is you know point bit point this is you know this is you know if the you know is not no formula you can able to do so, so what you do choose either any one value initially zero it is just you take up to zero once if you get this two values are good once if you put the u3 is equal to zero what value you will get tell me let's assume u3 is equal to zero what will get tell me see here i am assuming u3 is equal to zero then u1 i get are using which formula Uh, I will find five point formula using u one of zero. Can tell me what value will get? Diagonal point five is what? This value plus this value, then this value plus this value. Tell me u one of zero using diagonal five point formula. Anyone know? Come on. Uh, one what is u one of zero? Two two zero one by four. A U one of zero is equal to two thousand plus thousand. Then plus thousand plus zero. Because initially I'm assuming U three. Okay. Then once if I get the U one, uh, can I get the U two? This formula I will use plus U one by hand. Standard five point formula. Ah, uh, standard five point formula. What you will use? Thousand plus three zero. Plus U one plus five hundred, correct? Yes, sir. Then U four, you will get that actually this values and this value. Okay, U four, you will get what is U four zero? You can tell me. Diagonal five point formula. Thousand plus U two of zero, correct? Plus, what is this value? Two thousand, ah, two thousand plus zero. Correct? Ah? Yes, sir. Now you can use three of zero. Use three of zero. You can any formula can use diagonal five point formula. This in a up to now I assume use three zero, but after getting this, I will find out use three of zero. I can diagonal five formula and five point formula. What is doing this? This is. U one of zero, what it will done? Not down slowly. U two of zero will done. Then U four of zero will done. Then U three of zero is taking five point formula. What is finding five point formula means? But diagonal also can use nothing will happen. Because textbook because I want to don't change the values. I am doing this. U three of zero, U four plus zero, U two of zero plus zero. Correct or not? Yes. Sir. Once if we get the all values, then go for what? What formula will use? Leibniz equation. Ah, Leibniz equations. Now, u one half one. Now one by now tell me. From this figure, tell me. Otherwise, u one half n plus one only can tell. U one half n plus one. Now what will get tell me? This is n plus one position. This is n plus one position. This is n the position. This is n position. Correct? Yes. So u one half n plus one is equal to two thousand plus thousand. This whatever may be position n plus one, n plus two. These are fixed actually. Correct? Yes. Plus u four half n plus u two half n. Can you agree with me? Yes. Sir. Okay. Yeah. Now. I know u1 of n plus 1 I got. Once if I get the u2 of n plus 1, how can I write u1 of n plus 1 plus 1000, u3 of n plus 500? Correct? Huh? Yes, sir. Then u4 of n plus 1 is what? u1 of n plus 1. All the n plus 1 in my hand plus 2000 plus 500 plus u3 of n. By four, you don't forget it. By four, you don't forget it. Okay? Then u three of n plus one. Now can I write u four of n plus one by hand? 
u2 of n plus 1 my hand this is u3 u2 of n plus 1 then plus 0 plus 0 by 4 agree yes okay. sir are you getting an uh, not confusing you know, i am not confusing you making it no sir i understood sir clear correct no okay now right one by one slowly can write first you can find u1 of 0 u2 of 0 copy down then only understand See that e, u1 of 1, I am telling, telling n plus 1, I am preparing after that n is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, will do. That is better. Then u2 of 1, u1 of 2 means what you will get here? u2 of 1, u4 of 1, you have to write. Because if you write n plus 1 means what? Just n is equal to 1, 2, 3 means you will understand. That's what I am telling. Second, second iteration means what? This will get 1, 1. Third iteration means what? This will get second iteration means. If you are able to write okay, otherwise confuse means the n plus one you can write put n is equal to the net. Then it's similarly u2 of one is what u1 of one. Yes, second iteration is what this also will get second iteration. See the figure if you are able to write also okay. This is zero. One first iteration you get. Getting or not? This value substituted. Two. Just copy the figure. Diagram, you can copy it on first. These are points are U4, better you can write here and cross like this U4, U3, U2. Don't pass, copy it on. Sent in WhatsApp everyone. in your group WhatsApp the pair notes, this notes, lab was not existing. It's a very good problem. First, you can start with me. Then, iterations you have to do. First iteration, then second iteration. You see, here 2 means here 1, previously 0. Here, third item means second. Six one page mistake here. I will add it down there. The fourth iteration, third iteration mistake. Then sixth iteration. Seventh iteration. So sixth and seventh are same. One to two decimals are one decimal is stopped. Then he is telling this is the right answer. Are you able to do this? This is another type of problems. Let's read the problem. Solve the Laplace equation u x x plus u y y 0 for square which is showing the bounded the boundary values are shown using left by naive perturbation proceed to obtain the correct to integers. The up to integer values are not discussed also not to up to integers if you get same values you can stop.
Now you see this boundary condition is 0, 100, 200, 100, 0. Down also 0, 100, 200, 100. This is our 200, 400, 200, 0. Okay. Suppose if you consider a small paper, if you fold like this in this, this direction, I see this. I'm folding this side and I'm folding to this side. Correct? Like paper, I'm folding like this. In between paper to to flipping actually this side if you close means what will get this 200 200 same 400 400 same 200 200 same then from this what you will understand this is symmetry about vertical axis if it is symmetry about vertical axis means what you understand u1 and u3 are coincided u4 and u5 can coincide u7 and u9 coincide yes sir so now not down in notes u1 is equal to u3 by symmetrical about vertical axis given problem. Not on u1 is equal to u3, u4 is equal to u3, u7 is equal to u9. Okay, this you can treat as a paper. This you can fold as a with the horizontal axis is it? this 200, 200 coinciding, 100, 100 coinciding, 0, 0, this 200, 200 coinciding, this 200, 200 coinciding, this 0, 0 coinciding. Then which two are coincide? U1 and U7 are same or not? Symmetrical about horizontal axis means what? This time folding this, this side, I fold into this side. Like Front side you can fold in front of you, half of the paper. So what you will get is U1 and U7 are merged, U3 and U9 merged, U2 and U8 merged, correct? Right or wrong? Yes, sir. Then from this what you understand as the previously what I said, U1 is equal to U3 I am telling. U7 is equal to U9 and then now I am telling U1 is equal to U7. Now which values are equal now? Tell me. U1, U3, U7, U9 are equal. So, and U2, U4, U6, U8 are equal. No, no, no. Come on, come on. U4 and U6. U4 and U6 equal. Ah, yes, sir. U2 and U8 equal. Yeah. So, how many various points are now there available in the first term? U1, U2, sorry, U1, U3, U7, U9. One point, that's it. All are same. Yes, sir. Then U4, U6. U, U4 and U6 are same. Correct? Yes. Then U3, so 3 points, 4 points, if we find out enough of top 9 points. U5 is unique point, we count. Correct or not? Yes, sir. Now, how many points are equal? U1 is equal to U3 is equal to U7 is equal to U9. Any one point U1 you can write. Similarly, U2 is equal to U8, then U4 is equal to U6, that's it, correct or not? So, totally five different points are there. Once if you get the next time, as you know, the story. U2, then U4, U6, correct or not? Now, first if U50 you can find out, U50 you know. Standard diagonal 5.1 200, 200 plus 200, 200 by 4.
then u5 you can find 200 200 then u1 already you know familiar actually u1 if you know u5 you forget this diagonal formula once if you get once if you get you know u3 u7 u7 you can get. then you find u4 u6 then u2 is u8 so five points if you find out then again more story This is left hand formula, left to top to like this. Just you can write, is right you now normally u1 is equal to u2 of u4, u2. Five formulas if we end up with us, five only we need. This two, this problem at least try. Initial value got it means at least try now. Not also I sent you this check if you have any doubt. It is similar about x axis by x r is equal to nothing else. Sometimes you may get. Diagonal also, that problem some you do, at least this problem. Sorry. See, they have done eight iterations. Now to do eight iterations, at least first iteration, you can try one by one, you can try this problem. Notes already I sent you, just you can check. Don't copy down blindly, try to understand and see.
sir completed hello completing i just clicking all of you Okay. So you can do like this. Just say uh, you have notes with you. Just glance. You can check same values are getting. Just like go for the next problem. Ah, wait, I press it. This problem is a good problem. See. So all the U X express U Y Y following this pair match with the boundary values. See, he is given actually. If you fold like this means what? This three three this. Three. Like this, if you go means what? This two two, this three three, diagonally same actually. So what you will get? U one, U one, same value. Uh, if you fold like this, U two, U two. Actually, this cross you can fold. This corner you can put it, bring to this corner. This corner you can bring, you can bring like this. So what you get? These two are same. These two. Because this four point means I know initially I don't get so what I will do just u one is equal to zero or u two is equal to zero I expect let's start do the problem. Please assume first u two is equal to zero u one now zero is doing then u two of zero once it becomes u two of zero only. Let me now finish the music so. See the problem carefully. You can see this is diagonally symmetric. Ah, x axis y axis is symmetric. Then first iteration you can do. Second iteration you can do. Now you can check the hands once. This point is quite same. Maybe. These two are the same. Maybe. Only if you fold like this, means or these two are the same. These and these are as different. Getting or not? Are you able to do? Yes. Sir. So now, so that uh, with exercise again, I will send you. Don't worry. Uh, maybe this exercise uh, not included. Again, I will add and submit. Unit four, I submit yesterday. I send you that you can prepare from there. Again, unit five, again I will take and I will send you. If there is something you pay anything, add me, sir. Add, then I will send you. Okay. And then I will stop here. Okay. Then you can leave, sir.